So I started Strides because when I was a kid, I always wanted a horse. My parents were not horse people. And when I was 13, we got our first horse. We didn't know what to do. And we didn't have very much guidance or uh, know where to go or anything. So I suffered a lot of embarrassment <laughs> growing up, getting going in the horse world and going to events. I didn't want other people to suffer that same level of embarrassment that I did. And um, I just thought this would be a really awesome way to give back to the community. I feel like I've been missing a community piece in my life of other people and a positive horse environment. This is the best way I could think of to do that. So with kids and adults, we give riding lessons and teach them the fundamentals of horsemanship in and out of the saddle. So we teach kids how to saddle, how to take care of a horse, and really like everything in between. We have everything from beginners to advanced riders, everything from three-year-old little kids to 70-year-old people that are retired, and it is just really an awesome place to get started and get your feet wet with horses or if you used to have horses and you're wanting to get back into it this is the place to come. I got started with horses when I was in elementary school. I told my dad that I wanted a horse. He had me trade cords of firewood. I had to cut them and stack them. He had $250, which at the time was a lot of money. My dad was a single dad on disability. So we took the $250. I bought a crippled up paint horse with a sway back, and I loved her with my entire heart and soul. We did not know anything about horses, um, and I didn't really have anyone to teach me. So we learned as we went. We did a lot of things wrong. This community wasn't always the kindest growing up through that and I want to change that. I want to give kids the power and adults to own horses and make mistakes and have that be okay and be willing to learn. So 2020 happened and the world came to a standstill and I think everybody in their life went, what am I doing with my life? What do I need to be doing? What's my passion? And I sat long and hard with that question. I've been an entrepreneur my whole life. I've always been trying to start little businesses or sell things. And I was thinking, what do I really want? And then I thought, well, when was I happiest? And I thought, well, when I was happiest was when I was 13, 14. I was just turned loose on my little Mustang Appy horse and my little Arabian horse and I would just trot all day in the woods. And I thought, well, how could I, could I give that to other people? So I thought, well, what about a horseback riding school? So now we're doing that. This is our first year in business. I was a horse trainer for over a decade. I had a very good reputation in Oregon training all kinds of horses. We came to Longview, Washington, and we got this really beautiful little five flat acres right in town. So we're super accessible for everybody, easy to find. You won't get lost on a single lane gravel road trying to find us, which was a problem at our old house. And so I just thought, well, this is the perfect place to start a riding school. Having all my connections from my day's training, uh, it was so easy to find lease horses and horses to use for our program, TAC. So the community has contributed so much to us and we're just super appreciative of that. I believe in strides because I believe in anything that helps not only individuals but also the community. I think that we're going to do really big things in Cowlitz County and hopefully one day it'll transfer to hopefully everywhere. We wanna give every single person the best experience. I love working with this team. This is the first time in my life I've worked with a group of people that are like, yes! Like, 6 a.m. this morning, we've already worked out. You know, we're eating our keto meal, and we're like, let's get people on horses and give them the best time ever. Like, let's make this the best day of their life. And I don't know anywhere else that has that attitude about being up at 6 in the morning. <laughs> I feel like in the economy in the world today, a lot of people can't have horses. And if they can have a chance to feel like if you know one of our ponies or horses are the light of their lives, I want them to come here every day and love on it and live and breathe horses without having to own one. Southwest Washington, it isn't a huge horse community here. We're not like Texas um, or Oklahoma or Arizona and there's just not a lot of access to horses in general. So we provide that. We can teach you all the way from, you know, your first time on a horse, all the way to like, you're actually ready to go compete. 
I myself have competed in open shows and you know in rodeos and barrel racing. So we bring a lot of experience to the table in different disciplines. We also are open to all disciplines. So we're not really just like in one area. We do everything from barrel racing, open show, um, but also Michaela and I are looking at doing some endurance rides. I took jumping and dressage lessons last year. So we're just really open-minded and growth-minded here at Strides. Our website is stridesforsemanship.com. We're the first one that shows up. We're Strides Horsemanship LLC. To look us up on Facebook or Instagram, you just have to look up Strides Horsemanship. We'll pop up or Google us. If you look up Strides Horsemanship on Google, we're the first one that pops up. Strides Horsemanship LLC and my phone number's right there. I guess I just want to share what I've experienced, the positive aspects of horses with everyone.